if I could be in a room with anybody for almost three and a half months, you know who I'm choosing. I'm choosing Tim's um, or no, not Jessica Alba. I'm gonna choose Stacy Dash, but I know you're thinking that that's crazy. But the reason I would choose Stacy da- Stacy Dash is because the amount of black, like the amount of things that I could tell her about my culture that she don't know about, I think it's crazy. Like it's at least three months worth of information, so I could inform her on a lot of shit. And I think during that process, she'll probably fall in love, and then I'll be her first. You know what I'm saying? And I think that'll be cool. You know what I'm saying? Not necessarily full blood, but like close enough. You feel me? Chill shit. I built a massive isolation chamber. I'm not trying to change her. I'm just saying that I think that would be a realistic scenario for me to be in. You know, that's how I'm feeling. Nothing crazy, though. And we're going to see if these two strangers can survive in this chamber for the next 100 days. Not going to lie. This Mm -hmm. challenge would have turned X-rated considering the girl I'm locked in with. Consent given, of course. Oh, yeah, of course, but you definitely getting no bitches, bro. I'm sorry. It's just the way it is. They have never met each other. I'm praying for you, though. Ever. Bailey, this is Susie. Susie, nice this is Bailey. Nice to meet you. Hi, Bailey. nice to meet you. If the two of you can survive the next 100 days in here, I will give you the half a million dollars inside of this bowl. But if one of you leaves before the 100 days is up, you both get nothing. I'm a master troll. I'm leaving at exactly day 109. I mean, fuck. I meant 99. I thought it said one. All right. I think you guys understand the rules. Have fun. Hey, bye. This is going to be crazy. Day 32 of asking you to finally do the um, woofa food. I don't know how yeah. much I can take this you to This is actually room. like an insane Chill, bro. Chill, chill, chill. We're chill. currently looking at all the stuff we put in there. We gave them enough food for 100 days. Which is healthy, but basically the exact same thing over and over again. I can mix this up. We also gave them their own private bathroom, which comes with a shower and obviously has no cameras inside. And oh my god! Okay. We're good. I can definitely survive three months. A bed to sleep on. They have everything they need to survive 100 days. It's just a question of do they want it? I got a comb. I don't know if I've ever combed my hair in my life. Interesting. Yes. See how they're both standing on different sides of the room? They're so awkward. When I had them take their blindfold. Well, don't they don't do they know each other, Mr. Beast? Excuse the fuck out of me, Mr. Bitches. We'll talk. That was legitimately the first time they had ever met. I just keep thinking of the feeling like of exiting. Oh yeah. How good is that gonna feel? It's only a hundred sleeps. Only one hundred sleeps. And then the world will have just kept going. Mm-hmm. That's like what freaks me out. The most interesting part of this experiment is that in this room you have no idea what day or time it is. That's the messed up part number one, but the also horrible part about this is like you're just seeing a white room. Do the lights turn off? And already on night one, Susie and Bailey made the mistake of only sleeping for two hours. Which means they started their second day at 2.37 a.m. I'm just gonna oh my god. Just act like this is just... Would you do this? I would try. I think that I think that I could do it, but given who I'd be with, it de- it, it really is dependent of a lot upon who I'm, who I'm gonna be with. The new normal. Okay, what do you want to eat? Like, I don't think they got books, a laptop, no Are nothing. Are you feeling beef or chicken? Mm, chicken. Chicken sounds great. <laughs> nice. <laughs> It's good. As you can see, living inside a white cube is pretty boring. Besides eating the same thing over and over, time in the chamber consisted of two things. Trying to hide from the bright lights. The lights are just so bright that we have to make these things to shield ourselves. And desperate attempts to keep themselves entertained. Like on day four, when they used the paper from their... Jo- there is no way there's a spider that got in there. ...journals to make a deck of playing cards. Was that an actual spider? Like on day four... There's no way a spider got in the facility, dog. Or when they use the paper from their journals to make a deck of plain. If there's a spider that get in here, bro, I'm leaving. I swear to God. Cards. Is he making cards? All right, so I just finished my deck of cards. I think that they actually came out all right. Which honestly looked pretty fun. So I made myself a $30,000 seat and joined in. Nah, bro. 
On day five, they made a sign-in sheet, which was really just an elaborate trip. What is this? You have to sign our sign-in sheet. Oh, these are our camera people. Yeah, this is everyone that's come in today. Wait, wait a minute. You're having them do this so you can track the date and the time. Hold up, I need to borrow this. No, 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 I wrote the date. I wrote the date. Which I gotta say was pretty smart. But by the time we got to day seven, anything considered smart was thrown out the window. Bailey's lost it. <laughs> He's whipping the poor. <laughs> That's his natural instinct coming out. I automatically would have went off the. Yeah, I couldn't. I couldn't do it. Yeah. No. What if they gave me a man, bro? Three months in this cube with a nigga? Nah, bro. Bet he's never stood a chance. Five more throws. But I only need one. Let's freaking go, baby. It's actually crazy to me that already on day nine of this challenge, they're bored enough to expose the red line. That if they cross, they lose every dollar of their prize money. It is now day number 10. How you doing, Nolan? Good. And I got a pretty interesting offer. Whoa! <laughs> so it looks like they took the $500,000 and put 250 on her side and 250 on his to remind themselves of what's at stake. Just the whole door opening thing is so dramatic. You live with your brother, Sean. I've never lived with my brother, bro. I'm homophobic. How's it going? We're about to reveal the most interesting part of the challenge. I need you two to just face this wall. They don't even know oh that there's a door. Oh, my God. Let's do this. Oh. This is our first time seeing the outside world in 10 years. You are kidding me. Yeah. The sky! Every 10 days, I will give you something that will make the challenge easier. But if you actually want it, you'll have to pay for it with some of your prize money. And bro, that's not what that was not the agreement. My brother's not gay, chill. First, for day 10, we're gonna give you the option to buy a private chef that'll cook you whatever you want between now and the end of the challenge for fifty thousand dollars. Oh my god, fifty nah, we don't need that. We don't need that. On God, we don't need that. Now I will give you twenty-five thousand for a TV. <laughs> Or a laptop with internet that my partner and I could share. Wait, no, we each get our own laptop for twenty five for twenty five k. Be reasonable. Three months for a chef do not cost fifty thousand, bro. Be economic. Before you answer, if you want to give up some of your prize money, we're gonna let you have a nice meal. Use this as a floor for your imagination as to what you. And we don't we don't even guarantee that it tastes good. Like, do we get to request the food, or does he just bring in random plates? Be eating for ninety more days. You are kidding me. 50 grand's a lot, though. Okay, let's not think about it right now. These look like some people that have only eaten canned chicken for 10 days. I love just looking at the sky. You forget oh, those fries. But they literally haven't seen the sun in 10 days. Now I feel bad. After eating this, the thought of that food is like grossing is, me out it's even worse. Rough. They're starting to talk about whether they should take it. I don't know what to do. Nah, bro. This is a good first one attempt us with. Don't do it. Oh. Wait, do we get breakfast, lunch, and dinner? Like three different meals? Oh no. Oh, hey Jimmy. All right. It's time for the decision. Say no. Would Say no. Say no. Thousand dollars. Say no. For the rest of the challenge. Nope. I think we decided no. Good. Really? Good I shit. I honestly didn't think you guys would say Good no. Shit. no, no Good no, no, shit. Good shit. Wait, let me get a fry. I have another offer in 10 days. We'll see if you cave then. I really thought you were going to say yes. Mm -mm. That was crazy. Bye. Yeah. I'm really curious about what the next temptation is. I well. know. But you know what? I'm proud of us for staying strong. You Good thought, job. bitch. And now with the chef gone, it seemed like Susie and Bailey were already starting to regret their decision. Bon appetit. My favorite part is that you can hold it sideways. <laughs> <laughs> it stays on the plate. The next few days were pretty mind-numbing for the both of them. Their routine consisted of waking up, cooking food, and then eventually just going back to sleep. Man, the long Hey, best Would way to pass the time. Have a chef or canned food for consecutive days. Keep in mind you'll still have 450k that I have to split between two people. So as opposed to it being a cool 250 sure. a piece, I definitely would do this 90 day challenge with you crying face. Are you are you cooking the whole way through? Cuz like that's the only way that either of us are surviving to be honest. Longer I'm in here. Cuz if I leave it up to just me, then we're definitely going to need a chef. We're just going to starve. The more I feel like I'm sharing a space with an annoying sibling. <laughs> Whoa. Dead ass. That is insane, bro. This is either going to be the biggest confidence boost or like the biggest soul crusher being in a room with, you know, somebody like this for three, for three hours. I mean, three, three, uh, three months. You saying they're not fucking, but a lot can change. It's only day 14 almost. Are you talking about me? I've had a lot of relationships start off exactly like this. 
Who else? <laughs> and even though they were getting used to each other, one thing they weren't getting used to were the constant beaming light. It's just so bright in there. I came to the bathroom because the, the light, you can keep it off. So it's nice and like dark in here. Once it gets super late at night, I physically feel my eyes stinging just because of how bright the lights are in here. And because it was... I never said that, Prophet. I never said that. I literally just said I had them start off where like we wasn't fucking with each other at first and then boom, like I don't know what happened. It's so hard for them to get any Nobody said they had to. I'm just saying it's crazy somebody being a stranger saying you my annoying sibling. That's not crazy. I think it's crazy. Sleep. I had the perfect offer planned for day 20. Congrats, you're 20% done. Are you two ready for the offer? Yes. Yeah. Your day 20 offer is simple. I will give you each a smart bed that are super comfortable and combined will cost $50,000 of your prize money. This is so fucking dumb, bro. Like, give me a small... It don't cost... The bed don't cost that much. I will also give you this iPad with... 50K? The oh. ability to... Oh, what? Turn off the lights. That's such... It's not even completely dark. It's not worth it. Dang. They it's have not exactly worth it. one hour to decide if they want to spend fifty thousand dollars of their prize money for these beds. It's still way better than those lights they had before. The ability to turn off the lights. The answer might be yes. It's I not. Seen Susan. No, if you said no to the fifty k for the food, you better say no to the fucking bed, bro. But that looks so comfy, dude. Oh my god. This happy? I bet it's warm. Since we literally started the challenge. Let's remember what we would have to live with if we don't say yes. <gasps> oh oh my gosh. I think they're gonna take it. I I think we should. No, 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 no. It's only 10% of our money. It's decision time. No. Your one hour is up. This is what your eyeballs could have. But if you say no, this is what you're stuck with. For eight Nigga, you better close your fucking eyes. Eight days straight. Do you want these comfortable beds? I'm actually okay with whatever you say. Five. Four. Oh my gosh. Three. No. Say two. Yes or no? Bailey, yes or one. no? One. No. 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 Yeah! Really? Yeah! Okay, whoa. It's my fucking dog! I did not see that one coming. I think I made a mistake, maybe. Oh, what a heavy mistake. I cannot believe you guys yeah. said that. I'll leave yeah. you alone for a couple of days. Yeah. I hope you don't regret your decision. Yeah. Bye. Bye. I think we made the right decision. I can't believe that in the heat of the moment you said no. Oh. She just made him bitch. I feel that slight regret right now. I don't. It's cool. It's cool. I feel no it's regret cool. in your decision. <laughs> <laughs> it's cool. It's cool. So today I made my calendar. She a and real I was nigga. Just writing she a real my nigga. Mom's birthday. It's gonna be tough on that day, I think. Don't start crying out of chill. I'm so bored. I think that we're hitting a point where boredom is at like an all-time high. I woke up this morning and didn't feel like doing anything, so I just sat there and stared. Oh no, the silence what is do with this chilling. Much? I have a house. I was probably gonna pay a lot on the house. Oh, that's awesome. I wanna pay off my parents' debt. That would be like my ideal world. Throughout the following days, I made sure to not interrupt the routine. However, I was also taking note of things they missed from the outside world. Like on day 24, when I overheard them wanting seasoning on their food. Okay, if we had seasoning, That's what I'm saying. I like, could easily stay here 100 yeah. days. On day 27, Susie was craving coffee. I am a big coffee drinker, and um, I only have water. And on day 28, mm. Bailey clearly needed entertainment. <laughs> so by day 30, I had the perfect plan to get them to spend money. Okay, they had month... They at month one right now. 30 and it's time for another offer. How's it going? Hi. Today's offer is simple. Each of these five items costs $10,000. You can buy one phone call, the entire Harry Potter collection, your own coffee machine, spices, salt, and pepper for your- 10K is way more reasonable, okay? I still wouldn't want to spend nothing, but we could probably both get use out of the coffee machine. Monopoly, we could just talk, nigga. Like, we don't need to play games. I'm not giving 10K for spices. That was some bullshit he just tried to pull. What was the first one again? A phone call? No. No. I didn't tell everybody in my life about it at this point. Don't call me for three months. Nobody should be expecting to hear from me. If you don't get the coffee maker, get nothing.
food, or you can buy Monopoly for $10,000. You can buy one of them, you can buy all five of them. This is tough, actually. If you have 10 minutes to decide, just let me know what you want. I'm so nervous. This is a big decision. Coffee. Ooh, it does sound kind of nice. It does. And then the seasoning. Seasoning sounds nice, too. I'm doing this one 1,000%, I'll be honest with you. I don't really care about that. Sick. Coffee would be nice. It's like a treat every morning. I've made my mind up. Decision time. This nigga's actually about to spend 10K on Harry Potter right now. This is a dumb ass. Bro, like, you've made the worst decisions of the whole shit so far. <laughs> Easily my least favorite character. Are you buying Monopoly? No. Oh God. Are you buying the spices? No. no. Are you buying the coffee? Does it come with cream or sugar? If you say yes in three seconds. It, it, yes. Okay. Oh my God, bro. Yes! Are you buying the Harry Potter book? Yes. Y'all dropped 20k on this? Bro, I need a partner that understands that we are being taxed insanely for these ba these basic ass items. If you don't get me a deal for 2 to 5k with these items, bro, I'm not spending no money. Like he thought he had me with the $50,000 fucking bed. You thought you had me with the $50,000 chef for 3 months. I'm not stupid. I'm not dumb. Harry Potter and and Starbucks for 20,000? Are you buying the phone call? No. no. You bought a coffee machine and you could have called your mom on her birthday. What are we doing? I could have understood if you would have came to me heart to heart. I want to I want to talk to my mom on her birthday. But the coffee? Yeah, all right, bro. We finally got you two to buy something. This feels good. <laughs> it was a pleasure doing business. Thanks for taking your money. Most expensive coffee maker in the world. 30 days in, we got something new. That's exciting. We caved, you're welcome. That's my closet. That's my bookshelf. I can stay another 70 days easy. And we still have $480,000. It's crazy. Over the next few days, not a lot happened. She's already preparing a meal. It's like being married. The most interesting thing was when Hurricane Idalia took out the power on day 34. Oh, no way. No way. That's so fire. As you can imagine. See, imagine you spending a 50K on a bed and you got a night of darkness anyway. Our cameras became pretty useless. So oh, we can do anything right now. I'm just going to take you to day 39. How's it going? Hello. Hi. Hey. I know you guys have been struggling. I'm sorry it took so long. Hold up. Oh, there we go. That was a long delay. <laughs> you should be able to use your coffee pot again, cook food. You should have a hot shower. That's excellent. I'll see you tomorrow with the surprise. Oh, I'm so excited. Yay! The power's on. Look, it's light. It feels like cheerier. The lights are back on again. I just had a hot meal, hot shower. Life is finally looking up here. It is now day 40. Can I come in? Come, come in. in! Your gift at no expense um, wait. is this TV. But every single movie is $10,000. This is so dis- <gasps> Yo, you know this nigga actually is the devil. This nigga is the devil. That's what, that's what it is. All the all the all the uh all the criticism that he get on the line is actually deserved. Um I agree with all the think pieces that I've read. I think all of it like he's just corny as fuck. He corny as shit. He's corny as fuck, bro. There's just what does that even mean? A free TV with no movies, but the movies cost 10k a movie. And you got mad movies. Roll the shit out, bro. Get it out of my face, bro. Watch the pop. You have one hour to decide. Have fun. This is crazy, the amount of movies in here. We can watch a thousand would be reasonable. Ten, just whatever, bro. This document. But if we got to spend a thousand, bro, okay. Number one, we either going to be, okay. Like, if I'm considering all parties involved and it's close to Christmas, we got to get home alone, okay? The, the, the OG, we just got to do it. Just It just is what it is. We watching Macaulay Culkin and go crazy on these robbers. It is what it is. That or Boys in the Hood. One or the two. You get no in between. I'm gonna read about Nolan. <laughs> <laughs> we love Susie and- Man, this nigga wildin'. Bailey to discuss the offer and told them we'd be back later, but they didn't seem too interested. How about 10 grand for all? I'll go ahead and tell you now. No. You might as well just come in here because I think we both are uh, set in our ways. Okay. The best I could do is buy one, get one half off. 
Mm. Yeah, give me a deal, bitch. Can't do it. All right, gang, come on in. Take every last one. Good, good, good. They on my type of time right now. Oh, glad we keep this. Oh, not any of the Hunger Games? You can just reenact scenes from movies and save the money. Oh, my God. Are you okay? What did your parents do to you, bro? Did you have food growing up? You good, gang? I left the TV in the chamber to remind Susie and Bailey of what they could have had. But little did I know, they were going to outsmart me. An antenna is just a piece of metal. Rip this little wire off the wall. So I had to take this knife so that the wire is like frayed. I literally just plugged it into the antenna spot. Now we're gonna see if it works. Just anything, give us one channel. Oh! <gasps> There's no way. What are the odds of you finding a random nigga that knows how to do that? Like, come on. What? It says that there's seven digital channels. Oh my gosh. If this actually works. <gasps> what? Yeah, I know. Wait, I'm like actually shaking. Bailey! Currently, the only thing that we can get on the TV is a race car race. Never really been a fan. Oh, he's in second. But today, all of a sudden, we're huge race car fans. Our time is going to fly by. And yeah, Susie was right, because for the next six days, that's all they did. Having the TV feels like we're in purgatory. It's like almost normal life. It is my mom's birthday tomorrow. Even though I won't be able to spend the day with her, I got some time in here to make her a little birthday present. You are cutting up the fucking money. And as opposed to taking that call that you could have used today, you got a coffee machine. Just think about your shit and stop wasting the $10 that it took to build this fuck ass house, bro. This is actually insane, unhinged, and I'm reconsidering everything that we've done together. Although I didn't go out and buy something, I'm technically spending money on it. Tomorrow is day 50, so I'm gonna use toilet paper to do streamers and decorate the room. It's day 50. Oh. Oh, hey. So what do you think? Why would you do that? Your surprises today. I have no idea. This one is a very big one. All right, so the offer for day 50 is $20,000 for the both of you to see your families. They're in the other room watching that feed and they can hear everything we're saying. What? Hey, I miss you guys. Hi. I love you and I miss you. I'll be back in 10 minutes to hear if you're imagine, gonna take it. Imagine they came and you say no. Why would you invite them already? Like, why would, this is an evil person. The offer. Good luck. Ten minutes. This feels like a pretty easy oh decision. Gosh. What are your thoughts? Oh my gosh, I don't know. This might be the only chance in this challenge to see them until the end. Bro, it's day 50. We can survive another what? Oh, damn. <laughs> I didn't really think it through. I think it's a no-brainer, personally. So it's up to you on if we spend 20 grand for both. Of course, I want to see my parents, too. Whoever said for it, Jesus ban yourself. You so... He's a yes and she's a no. Dad, tell me what to do. <laughs> All right. What are you thinking? Where are you guys at? He's been a yes from the beginning. As I... soon as you said it. About 10 seconds left. But it's my mom's birthday today. Uh -huh. We're saying yes. All right, give me $20,000 and I'll go get him. Best 10K ever spent, I think. Okay. They paid the 20 grand. Come on in. So Man. <laughs> This nigga bought a coffee machine, didn't take the call, and still got to see him for another 20K? We already deep. Oh, bro. Mama gonna have to understand. I'm just saying. I made you a birthday. And to celebrate her birthday, we brought a birthday cake. Yes. This is the best tasting thing they've had in forever. Little things like that that you don't realize you won't have until you're in it. Bye. We love you. Bye. That's the worst feeling so far. The highest of highs, and now back to our little cube all alone. Like I said earlier, the things we're offering them are based off of what we're overhearing them talk about in the queue. So you better believe that when Susie said this... Probably the only thing I'd say yes to at this point is like, if they do Tesla. You already know on day 60, I knew exactly what huh? to surprise them with. How's it going? Hi! Oh hey, first things first, I brought you a giant mystery gift. Tesla. Yay! Do the two of you want to spend $50,000 to keep what's inside of this box? Hmm. It's either going to be the best moment of their life or the worst moment. Just give me your answer in an hour. Great. All right, thanks. We'll be thinking. That's actually great. It's super nerve-wracking too, by the way. And again, evil. Thank you. 59 minutes remain. 
think we should. I know, I Maybe think it be. might be worth it. Imagine it is something great and we said no. Would it ever be a car? <laughs> well, it could be. It could actually be the keys to a car. It's not gonna be equal to the value that we're spending. She's right, it's almost three times more. I don't feel conf- Why randomly give me something that, that that's that crazy though? Damn. A Tesla don't even cost, oh, but what model? You know, I hope it, it would never. Put it in the yes. Then let's say no. But are you sure? Yeah, if you're not confident. I just know they would never do a car. They yeah, they would. Really? Yeah, I feel like they could do anything. Let's just say no. Wait, now you have me wondering to say yes. This is my late thing. Uh, I have to do it for my Decision time. Okay, do you want to spend $50,000 to keep what's inside this box? Trey, please. Yes or no? No. Really? What is your answer? Uh, I'm going with no. Really? Yeah. I can't believe you guys didn't take it. Do you want to unlock it? Sure. I actually don't want to unlock it. I think that's the better option. Like the alternative to that is like me not seeing it. Just don't show it to me, bro. All right. Inside. What? Huh? It's $50,000. So you would have got your money back. And then you want to open up that stack of money? Just grab Wait. Yeah, nah. I did, I, all right, bro. Yeah, bro. Whatever, man. This is the shit, like, this is the shit I'm talking about, bro. A free, a free car? Grab that. Uh, here is a Tesla key for you and a Tesla key for you. Yeah, they fool so well, Tesla keep winning lol. You. <laughs> I'm so sorry. They would have gotten their money back plus these two Teslas for free. Oh, I want to cry. Oh, let's close this. That's literally my dream. We're going to head out. You leave their beef. Thank you. Bye. I feel That's defeated. wild. Bailey! They got us Teslas! I feel like we made the wrong decision. No more pussy for you, Bentley. Whatever the fuck your name is. I'll regret this forever. Nah. Yeah, I will. Nah. Oh no, it's all a dream. Nah. I like my Prius. Okay, there I said it. And after getting hit hard by yesterday's offer, Susie literally whined about the Tesla for nine days straight. It's really hard to see the positive in all this. I like actually won't be able to sleep. I'm actually feeling sick right now. I'm so mad. Susie's taking it hard. And so to make up for it, I made sure this next offer was the best one yet. It's day 70. Today's a big day because this is the last offer. So obviously on day 80. You're this is the worst video I've ever seen in my life. Like there's only 20 days left. He's and on day 90. Away from becoming jigsaw. Yeah, he's actually an evil person. You're gonna be like, why would we spend money? There's 10 days left, correct? Yeah. Let me just open the doors. Oh God. No shot you reject this offer. What you see here oh is God. everything you said no to so far in this challenge. Before I tell them the price tag, I'm gonna move everything in here. I'm gonna make it as easy as- Wait, in the mystery box? Possible for them to say yes. Nolan, Chris, put those by the TV. Oh. Why the fuck would you do that? Oh. As much as I love to bully Nolan, he's just dumb. <laughs> Here's a bed. If you guys say no, we have to move all of this back out. Well, then give us a good price. What you are considering buying is these two $30,000 beds, a brand new mystery box. This one doesn't have. Oh my God. Whatever, bro. Whatever, bro. 50 grand Take it back out. Else. Take it the fuck back out, bro. Take it Sounds out. Like mm -hmm. 25 grand. Take it One out. One phone call Take it each. Out. Spices Monopoly. Take it out! Every single movie in the Walmart movie aisle. And lastly, the cook you said no to. Ooh, oh, there is a plate of food. I see a lot of good food. And to remind you how good it is, here's some chicken Alfredo. That looks it's so right. good. It's time to find out how much this will cost you. Behind these curtains is a number. If you bid higher than that number, you get everything here for the rest of the challenge. But if you say $1, one penny lower, you get nothing. 
I'll give you an hour to figure out your bid. I'm thinking, what if it's like way low and they want us to say You don't even give them a hit. I think if we bid 75, right now, that would be too little. Whole whole They're thinking at least 100K. I actually feel like we should go a little bit lower. I believe Because we were prepared to say no to it. That's true, but are you prepared to walk away with nothing? And while they're deciding what to do, I want to tell you about the shop app. The shop app is the- Bro, well, fuck you in at app. Gives us space. I get what you're saying, but imagine that was the reason why we didn't end up getting all this. Yeah. I would be so sad. Shop app so will wait, even they have to guess the amount without going a dollar below it? What would you pick? What would I do? And the number could be any number? And the way this nigga brain work, I'm thinking it's either super dangerously low or dangerously high. But you can't even be in between. He didn't even give him a hint. He could have gave him a riddle. And then when you figure out the riddle, like, whatever, bro. Track all your packages in one place so you'll know exactly when they'll arrive for the holidays. 100000 and $100. Yeah, it's not really that much damage. Yeah. Yeah, okay. This is, this is the one. Ready? Yeah. Official. All right. We're flipping it. I hope we get it. Let the Shop App AI Assistant scan hundreds of millions of products all over the Shop App to recommend the perfect gifts. All right, I get it. $100,101. Chandler, reveal it. Oh my god! Okay. You overpaid cool. by 30. I don't care. Wait! They had to give that up? Duh, that's some bullshit, man! Oh my god, dude. Why would you even bid a hundred K in? That you we had to pay for it why are you offering this then hello i didn't know that oh, okay all right bro this is literally half our time in here if we'd have been in here knowing that we'd be competing for 350k basically that would have reduced the time that we had to spend in here from 100 to probably 60 days like what Yo, this is Yay! the most excited of We on day 70. We got we got less than three weeks left and we just dropped a hundred K. Nah, bro. Oh and so far. Gosh. And this mystery box, which I did clarify was different, it's two yes. smaller Tesla. No. Um, alright, bro. Yeah, whatever, dog. Oh, I love this. I'll be teaming up with the shop app to grant thousands of wishes this holiday season. I'll tell you more about it at the end of the video. Our room feels drastically different right now. It's a dream. We now have so many things to do. It's like a vacation. It's this is a nice size for a master bedroom now that I'm thinking about it, though. Like, my brain is going all types of places with this interior design-wise. It's an investment, for sure. I think it was well worth $100,000. You may think, oh, the challenge is over now, but one of them may lose everything. You'll see on day 99 what I'm talking about. Oh my god, this is crazy. Now, you would think that getting all this stuff would make both of them a lot happier. But strangely enough, the opposite actually started to happen. One thing I took for granted on the outside was a hot shower that I also did not share with anyone. The hot water tank here runs out so quickly and Bailey always showers before me. So I've been stuck showering with cold water for honestly a couple months now. Wouldn't have to have that problem if we just took a shower together or reduce shower time. We've been playing the same Monopoly game for like seven days because- but These are like the bitches of complaints right now. Because Susie refuses to play. Like I, maybe she just hates board games. Uh, I think we need to take- No, she just hates you. Take like three days and cram as many movies as we can. All she ever does is read or watch movies. We gotta have like a movie marathon. So whenever I'm like, can we just finish that game? She's like, yeah, yeah, yeah. And then it never ends up happening. It's impossible to get her to focus. Hey, do you want to watch The Notebook later? No, I the notebook. Don't want to watch the notebook later. We just spent the last. Always a thinker. Always, bro. Think with your third eye. That's like 25 minutes. Not with the one downstairs. Just trying to choose a movie. And Susie, what did you say you're about to go do? Shower. Sorry. She literally does this all the time. 
Yep. Bailey is wired right now. This happens literally every morning. He is just nonstop so energetic all the time. I just had to come in here because I can't go anywhere else. That's a rave right there. Bailey, it's 3 a.m. Yeah, but sometimes you gotta rave. <laughs> oh, get me out of here. You're the worst. Do you play Monopoly? Nah. They are about you know the dice are? Scrappy. Yeah. I hid them. Because you keep asking me to play, so... Damn. I was like, maybe if I just hide them, then we'll never be able to play. Wow. What do I do in this situation? I mean, at this point, I got to break the TV. We going tit for tat. Are you cutting socks? <gasps> uh, your toes look so long. What the fuck? Why would you do this? Long. No, that's sickening. My dogs are barking. You. Uh... I would like to be saved. Mom, I'm ready to. Oh, so he. Okay. Leave. Even though at this point they could hardly stand each other, with the end so close, they set their differences aside and counted down the days. Four days left. Three. And Bailey, well. It's gonna be. Really couldn't wait to walk out those doors. No, I wasn't in the middle of saying anything. All right. Day 99. For me, it feels like it's been honestly an entire year. I can't imagine what they're feeling. Well, I have to brush my teeth one more time. Ever. Um, 24 hours remain! This many. Yes. So this is the first second of the challenge when you both walked in. Oh my gosh. How is that yeah. us? <laughs> I feel like I look like I'm a fetus in that. <laughs> Come on in, gentlemen. Set it up right above the door. I'm mad as fuck. I'm not going to lie to you, bro. This is so exciting. You officially have 24 hours left in the challenge. Don't forget what I said. We got a fun twist for tomorrow. I'm scared. Do you think they'll still be friends after this? Depends what their answer is tomorrow. I'm worried that it's gonna be double or nothing. He's so like quiet about it. You can't it. guess. Yeah. And with their final- It could be one of those like, you take all the money for yourself and your partner get nothing. Night coming to an end, it was time to present them with an opportunity to double their money. Oh, hey everyone. This is chaotic. What is going on? I don't know. This oh, big boy. I want to help, but not really. They're literally just taking everything. Do you know what these are? Those are our blindfolds from the first day. That was quick. I remember it like it was yesterday. If you would both please put them back on. Let's see if they want to double their money. Yay! Oh my God. After that dumbass decision y'all made earlier, you might as well. My heart is actually beating out of my chest. A hundred days ago, they were strangers. One hour ago, they were best friends. Let's see if they become total enemies. Bailey and Susie, take your blindfolds off. So, oh, nah, I was joking. You might be familiar with what we're about to offer you. <laughs> you each have the choice to split the money and nothing changes. You both hit split, you just split it, keep what you have. Or if you hit steal, you can steal the other person's money. And if you both hit steal, you would get nothing. There's no way, yeah. We gotta be safe and just hit split. What if one person, wait, so if somebody hits steal, they get everything? Nah, bro. Susie has earplugs in and noise cancellation headphones on top of them. She can't hear us. Kyle, what's going through your head? I don't even like know. Susie, if you pet steal, I <laughs> can't imagine. What do you say to somebody that steals 180 whatever? Maybe you get ahead of it and you steal it. There. You hear that? Bailey act. Chat, I'm not gonna lie. I'm getting what's mine. Actually, might. Bailey might. All right, throw the music back in his ears. What? If Look, okay. I'm. I'm gonna just go ahead and take all the benefits and the proceeds, right? In the process, I'll break you off like fifty thousand. You know, on some chill shit. While we were over there, he was like, "Oh, it's not like he could sue me." This is a no-brainer. It's too much money. We would never speak again. You guys have become like such close friends. We are not gonna speak anymore anyway. Why are you acting like that? Y'all spent three months in here, didn't touch each other once, most likely. Why are you acting like we don't be best friends? I might as well take it, to be honest. I don't know, you get to know anyone, and when 
You don't know me Lawrence like that. Lawrence should pick Steel Lime or just be going in the same life direction as Jonathan Majors. Relax. I'm through the same thing and like how hard this challenge has been. Like we both deserve- They didn't clap at all. I, I doubt it. Deserve half for sure. But now you make me nervous. Like I could do it too. Whoa. Why is she so rich? What did she just say? Maybe it'll be a case of you think you know someone. I don't know. If both of them press the steal button, they literally spend a hundred days in this room together for absolutely nothing. There's 30 <laughs> seconds left in the challenge. At the very last second, I want you both to place your vote. Do you want to walk away with 360 grand or half of it? No one speak. Carl and Chris, you two don't talk either. I know that Susie's gonna split, but the thought of walking away with almost $360,000, that could do so much. Do you want to split the money or steal it? The fact that I entered this challenge Three. knowing that there would be Okay, let's let's be one three sixty split down the middle is what, like one eighty a piece? Wow, I fucked that up. Okay, wait, let me just take out my calculator real quick. I knew the answer though. I knew the answer. Wait, I was right? I knew that. Mm, I knew that. But how are you going to say I'm right and then call me a dumbass when I got it right? My instincts told me immediately what the correct answer was, so get off dick. Clearly, I showed my intelligence right there. Offer it. Stop. Pretty dark times ahead. Two. And I still over... 180 is decent, but 360 is better. I'm taking... I'm, I'm taking my... I'm taking... Came all those things. One. There's no price you can put on that. No Wait. way. If the room turns red, then someone stole. If the room turns green, then you split the money. There's no way. You both chose split. Uh, yes. Congratulations, let's ride. Yes. Here we go. Here's your money. Get both out here. Hey, like Who are these niggas? In the video, don't forget to download the shop app. If you go on my store in the shop app, you can tell me whatever you want for the holiday, and I'm gonna be fulfilling thousands of missions. You can say like a Tesla. Yu-Gi-Oh cards, Beast Bowl bars, doesn't matter. Thank you, Shop App. I appreciate you so much. And as always, let's blow this place up. Nah, bro, that hundred thousand dollars that they spent, that that might be the biggest fumble. Just going back to think about it, bro. That that's just like, oh my god. We only needed to survive less than three more weeks. I, I, I'm still, even if like we both get out with the 180 a piece, I'm still sick over that. Still sick over that, bro. We could have just not participated in the game, I'm sure. Would have been 250K each. Nah, it would have been probably like 220 or something like that. Because they had already spent like 40 on the espresso machine or whatever it was. The movie. No, the, the books, the Harry, Potter, the Harry Potter books. And then they did the parent viewing. But it would have been better than that. 100K randomly. Jesus, man. That just that just killed me.